Hi, we're just here at Dundon Castle in Hamilton. Hamilton is about 45 minutes west of Toronto, about the halfway point to Niagara Falls. So we're just going to be taking a tour inside. It's a guided tour about every hour. Okay, here's the story. It's saying it was built in 1835 for Alan Napier, incorporating the farmhouse. Uh, it talks about the design there. Uh, it says here is political businessman, land speculator, soldier, very public life, successful lawyer, appointed to Upper Canada's first Queen's Council. He was knighted in 1838 for the role in suppressing the rebellion in Upper Calendar, Canada. Um, more details there. start in the basement in the servants quarters and then make our way up to the family's portion of the house. A workstation for one cook here out of the 12 servants. The kitchen is as large or larger than many people's homes were at this time so you can imagine a family of wow. and the amount of light given off by a candle versus the gas light. So the servants here at Dunring Castle were able to work a lot longer in the day because it was a lot bright. Family upstairs eats four. Breakfast, lunch, afternoon tea, and dinner. The servants downstairs eat three. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And those apple slices, herbs, all kinds of fruits and vegetables coming out of the garden. Those are stored then and then rehydrated those wires are snaking through the walls and floors of the, the house to little handles upstairs in the family's areas. When the family members turn a handle called a bell pull, it tugs one of these wires and a bell rings. Ah. Ah. And the servants are just some music. Yeah. room for the 12 servants. They would eat three meals a day, as I said, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They tended to be one pot style meals. Easy for the cook to make. They're on, and all the other men and boys sleep in the or sleep. Slept. Ringing one of the 11 bells that you saw down in the kitchen. 
The painting that you see here shows you McNabb's middle daughter. Her name is Sophia. Men are using it for drinking, smoking, and gambling. No ladies, no children allowed. The small room is left. The main room is the library. smaller if they're entertaining a small number of guests here. It also gets a little bit larger than it is right now and 24 people can comfortably see, sit around this space um, at its fullest extent. Here's the white. So the first room you want to see in the hallway here is the butler's bedroom. Remember all the other men who worked in the By the time they get a little bit older. So Sophia, the middle daughter, ends up with a room on the right. Pardon me, Minnie or Mary, the younger daughter, ends up with a room on the left. The rooms that you'll see up the stairs are the family bathroom and then Aunt Sophia's bedroom and sitting room. Okay, so just finished the tour of the Hamilton Military Museum. As you can see, it's just facing Dundurn Castle, which is back there. So, yeah, it's quite good. It's only $14 admission. Let me come back in camera range. So it's $14 admission. You have to buy your tickets online uh, right now because they're only allowing 10 people per session uh, due to restrictions and distancing and stuff. But um, yeah, it's worth a visit. It's very interesting. Um, yeah.
So we're just at the back of Dundon Castle here. So thanks again for watching this travel video. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell. Check out my other travel videos from Niagara, Russia, <laughs> I go blank now, Norway. I don't know what's on my channel, but just check out my other videos. And thanks again for watching.